Hi, my name is Alex Livingston. I'm a fourth year PharmD and MBA candidate at the University of Maryland. My path to pharmacy school has been kind of a wild ride. Funny enough, I was a car salesman in undergrad. And when I had started uh, school at The Ohio State University, I didn't really know where I wanted to go. My parents didn't really go to college, so they didn't guide me and I'm the oldest of my family. So I kind of tried a lot of different things. I switched majors over 10 times to really figure out you know, what I enjoyed and what I was passionate about. I ended up realizing I was passionate about business and science and talked to my academic advisor who actually introduced me to the PharmD MBA pathway as an ability to do both and combine them and pursue a career where I get to use my business acumen as well as my clinical knowledge as well. So what interested me to go to the University of Maryland was a first off looking at schools that had PharmD and MBA programs. Not all the schools in the country have the ability to pursue both degrees, so that was the first thing that I looked into. Upon further review of the university, I discovered the pharmapreneurship. Of course, the University of Maryland is the only program in the country with a pathway in entrepreneurship, specifically as it relates to pharmacy. That, of course, was very interesting to me because of the ties of both business and science. I decided to look further into the program and realized that at that time I wasn't considering being an entrepreneur, but down the road I could see myself pursuing a pathway in entrepreneurship and really wanted to open the door for opportunities as they presented themselves through the pathway. One of the things that was alluring to me about the pursuing a career in pharmacy is that you can go a ton of different ways. Knowing that I had been a background in both business and science, I didn't see myself going down the straight clinician pathway. I really wanted to use my business acumen. The amazing thing about pharmacy school and also the career in pharmacy is that you can pursue anywhere that you want. You don't have to necessarily be a clinician and work in the hospital, nor do you have to work in the community setting but you can work in the pharmaceutical industry as well as consulting and a plethora of other opportunities. For that, I realized that I didn't have to figure out exactly when I started school where I was going to be, but I knew that I would have the opportunity to pursue a plethora of careers with a PharmD degree. I'm the first student at the University of Maryland to pursue both my PharmD at the University of Maryland School of Pharmacy in conjunction with my MBA at the University of Maryland Smith School of Business. Now I started that a year after pharmacy school is when I started my MBA and became a full dual degree candidate. Now creating the path was certainly not easy as there were a lot of uncertainties and inherently no one I could really go to to kind of guide the way for me. But I found that challenge unique and that I could make the experience exactly how I wanted it to be. I could pursue something in a different area or specialization through both pharmacy and business school that was where I felt myself developing a lot of my skills from. Rather than following in the path of other students, being able to create the path gives you a ton of opportunity and flexibility. So with that, I reached out to professors at both universities and told them that I had been in both programs and just started in my PharmD MBA during my second year and I was looking to get the most out of it. I said, what are the opportunities that I have to be flexible in the programs? What electives can I take? How can I utilize skills that I'm getting from one degree and apply them to the other degree? And having open conversations with the professors, they were very supportive in finding the opportunities that I would have to use my knowledge from one program to the other. So while it was intimidating at first, I found the support group that I developed through both of the programs really helped me to not only develop my skills, personally, but also apply them to both programs and hopefully build up the programs and bridge the gap between the two degrees to a full encompassing PharmD MBA program. I definitely think the biggest point of advice that I can offer people is to reach out and speak to people. The more that you can talk to, the more opinions that you will get. I found largely a lot of the decisions I made were from me talking to other people and, and getting different perspectives and insight into decisions that I hadn't previously considered. For my MBA, for example, I talked to a plethora of alumni, current students, and faculty members about the program to get a wide variety of perspectives into exactly the value that the MBA could bring. Now, everyone grabs different value from experiences, but the more people that you can talk to, the more perspectives you can see, and you can really form a holistic view of that experience after talking to a wide variety. So don't shy away from opportunities to meet with people, even if it's a 30 minute conversation over coffee. You really never know what you're gonna gain in insight from a conversation. You also never know where that conversation will take you. I know that for my experiences, I've had multiple opportunities that 
presented themselves through conversations that at the time did not seem like that they would develop into much, but because I kept an open mind and maintained those relationships, they really blossomed into opportunities in the future.